Hi YouTube, I wanted to do a quick video on the XT60 connector that powers uh, the Ender 3s. They use this connector to um, separate the power supply from the rest of the system. And as you see, the way it's built is it has one end with these two pins and these other end with these two collars, sleeves really. So the way it's designed to work is these pins are separated and as the separations are supposed to be splayed out so when they enter the sleeve they get forced in and get pushed into the sleeve now that ensures really good contact because all these connectors rely essentially on friction in order to make sure you have a good electrical contact between them um, the friction ensures that the uh, the mating surfaces get maximized uh, between the two and uh, also to eliminate arcing because if there's any kind of minor vibrations which these 3d printers love to put out lots of vibrations um, any movement or vibration can cause these connections to uh, connect and disconnect repeatedly and uh, that arcing can lead to a lot of issues so um, you need these pins to be splayed out a little bit in order to ensure this good connection. Otherwise, you're going to get a high resistance and you're going to get arcing. And both of those can cause lots of heat. And that can be maybe a reason why a lot of people are having trouble with some of these connectors um, starting to uh, melt. So I had to do this on mine because I had one connector that looked completely normal the way it should. The other connector, though, was pretty much completely pressed together. That means uh, it would have fit very loosely inside the sleeve and would have caused all kinds of issues. So the simple thing is just to take the screwdriver that comes with the printer and actually get it into these slots and push them apart just a little bit. It doesn't take too much. You don't want to go crazy on it, but you want to keep those things apart and separated that keeps these uh, essentially the petals of this pin separated apart so when you go to push it together you get a solid connection and you won't have any heat issues